we will go if Biafra and Odudua leaves Nigeria, Senator Ekpenyong said. Senator Christopher Ekpenyong is currently representing Ikot Ekpene Senatorial District of Akwaibom State on the platform of the People Democratic Party PDP after defeating Senator Godwin Akwabio of the All Progressive Congress APC in the 2019 election. He served as deputy governor during Obong Victor Atta's administration. In this interview, he bears his mind on the agitation for the self-determination by some sections in the country. He also spoke about the chances of the People Democratic Party to reclaim power to the center, following failed promises of the ruling of Progressive Congress, APC. I don't know what happened or what happened this morning. I pray to God to strengthen our unity. I believe in unity, in diversity. No tribe in Nigeria is so self-sufficient. God blessed every part of this country with both human and natural resources. The North, with its vast landmass, produces potatoes, onions, gold, tin, ore, tomatoes, and others. Bitumen, cocoa, are found in the West. And from southeast down to the south-south, we have oil palm, coal, limestone, and the mighty crude oil, which is the only thing that is keeping Nigerian warm today. Hmm. So for me, if Odudua and independent people of Biafra IPOP are saying they want to succeed, I am waiting for them to take the first step. Then we will follow after them. We are marginalized, humiliated, oppressed, yes. But let us try not to make the mistake of the past. I saw the civil war even though I was very young. Those boys that are agitating for war today have not seen war. I believe that there is something fundamentally wrong with Nigeria, but our diversity can work if we do the right thing. Unfortunately, you see one part of the nation oppressing the rest. Today, all security apparatus are headed by one tribe, which has never happened in the history of Nigeria. We have over 250 tribes in Nigeria. And why can't we interact with each other, coexist? Why can't we respect every group instead of one ethnic group oppressing others? I was six years old when Nigeria had its independence. And after 60 years, I am still crying about the marginalization, subjugation, denial of rights, oppression of people of my area, the then eastern region. So I wouldn't say no to Odudua. I wouldn't say no to IPOP because it could be the few that their people have been pushed to the wall for too long. Since 1960, we have made tremendous improvements in some areas. The airports that are available today were not there. Most of the universities that we have today were not there. I think what we were able to build was University of Nigeria and Suka UNN then, Amadu Belo University, Zaria, ABU, University of Ibadan. So most of what we have today is a product of our independence. However, the decayed infrastructural facilities are worrisome, and with our massive wealth, most of our roads are still in bad condition. Particularly in the south-south, southeast, since the civil war that ended in 1970, we are still not seen as part and parcel of Nigeria. We are marginalized 
humiliated. That is the way I look at it. But as an independent nation, we have tried to grow. We would have made mistakes, yes, but we have tried to correct our mistakes as a result of our mistakes. There was a civil war between 1967 to 1970, and if not for many years the military was in power, I think we would have feared better today, even after they handed it over to the civilian government in 1979. They still came back in 1983. We are religious, doing well too, and the military came and organized the country. They created states, even the states they created. Thank you for listening to this news. Hmm. Senator Christopher Ibeo, you have spoken well. You have spoken well. You see, if you give Nigerians opportunity to speak, I tell you, you will see reasons why this country should be splitted. And that is the main reason why President Mubari doesn't want protest. That is the reason why President Mubari doesn't support protest. Because he knows that Nigerians has it inside. They have the words. They have a basic knowledge of the atrocities this country have committed in the past. And if pushed to reveal it, this country will be divided in a second. You understand? This is Senator Ebenyong. You understand? This is Senator Ebenyong. He is six years old when Nigeria gained independence. And we thought that Nigerian independence after the independence of Nigeria, that is when uh, uh, that, uh, that, uh, that it, mean, it means that he, 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 he witnessed the war before the independence to say. You understand? So maybe during the war, he may be like five years old while in the, during the independence. He clocked six years. And even as a little boy, he knows what war is all about. He was even lucky to have survived. You need to see things yourself. My viewers, this is not what we should be discussing. I'm telling you. There's no what we should be discussing. Because if you see what Nigerians went through, even you yourself will shed tears for them. You will cry for them. You will cry for them. But then I will tell you, sir, that their friends still focus on that dream of actualizing their goal. So anyone that want to come after Biafran are free to come. But Biafran are on their own. They are not carrying anyone along. Let anyone that want to actualize freedom go on their own. They should go and actualize. Biafrans are not actualizing with any other public. They are not with Odudua. They are not with Niger Delta Republic, they are not with Benin, they are on their own. They, they have been pursuing, pursuing this freedom for years. And now it is time for them to actualize it. No one should distract or to stop them. If you, your, 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 your republic want to come up after Biafran, good and fine, let them come up. But as it is now, Biafran are saying that they are on their own. Okay, so um, my viewers, what's your take? What do you think? Please, deem it fit to leave your comments below the comment box. Click on the subscription button as well as the bell button to get updated 
whenever we upload any new videos. Thank you. Mm -hmm.